tell everyone. Last show we said, go harass comedian Ron Weiner. I love how these guys think that we're going to say Weiner, by the way. It's Weiner. There's no such thing as the last name Weiner. Okay, that, that's just a bunch of wieners who are embarrassed, as they should be. That would be like if your last name was Ass. You know, hi, I'm Mike Lass. <laughs> it's just a terrible last name. Change your name. If, if, it, it, you, you can't grow up good as a wiener. I know there was a bunch of guys in the news as a wiener once, you know, sending screenshots, some politicians and stuff like that. Oh, did you see the election? That was a good time. I really liked the election. That's all. <laughs> it's a political segment. Uh, what was I saying? I was saying Rob um, Weiner. Rob Weiner. So we met this guy, and this is called Discovery. We're just starting to realize what we hate about this guy. He's an older man. He's a in his forties, probably. He's a comedian. He's a guitar comic, and he makes really, really whack songs. Maybe can you find? Just go like on YouTube, type in Rob Weiner. See if we get a song. So we met this guy on Amy Schumer. Inside the Schumer. So during the pandemic, Rob Weiner sent Amy Schumer his music, and we're here to harass Rob Weiner. I bet nobody's bothered this guy in 10 years. That's what I really love to do on this show. I like to see people waste their time with Brendan Schwab every day harassing him. You've scared him off the internet. He's not even reading it. So what's the point? I like to go for a man who hasn't had a scare in quite some time. Rob Weiner. He thought his life was all fine. He thought everything was great and nobody's going to bother him. He's, he's an adult now, right? The bullying has stopped. No. So when I see a guy, like, I, I could tell, too. I could tell who hasn't been really thrown against the wall in a long time. Is this one of his songs on Instagram here? Yeah. Dear Robbie... You'll see, you're going to hate this guy, too. I don't even buy napkins anymore. You can just get them for free anywhere. Yeah, we played this one last show. Here he is. This is Rob Weiner, and I'll tell you why we're showing him in a second. Never buy napkins. It is real. It's a thing. It's my thing. Never buy napkins. You can go anywhere, and they're there. Now, everybody hates him. Agreed? Agreed? Brother's promise? Me and Jules are brothers now when we do something called a brother's promise. You know about that? Brother's promise, Jules. She goes, what is... The other day I go, brother's promise? And she goes, what is a brother's promise? I go, I can't keep you up to speed. Jules, you gotta pay attention here. <laughs> so this is Rob Weiner. And, I mean, that could be Rob Weiner, too. These guys know nothing about shades. There's a lot of money Say. And he thinks he's so fucking clever. I hate a song like this. Hates. And I make songs. I'm a song guy, you know? But I don't like songs like this. When you look, around, look at this limb. It's beta cut. Everything got a price tag on it. Is it illegal to push a lib down and crack his head against the pavement? Jules, mm -hmm. I ask you with all the legal. Jules is a lawyer. Jules is our lawyer. Is it illegal to take a lib and smash his fucking head into the pavement? I found this on the web. Well, what'd she say? Do I have to appear in court or can my attorney appear? For this is literally what it pulled up on the old iWatch. <laughs> Those are so cool. It's this LED watch that I got from uh, this computer brand. We can take napkins back. That would make you feel better. So we had okay, a harassment. Him. Fuck. No, not enough. I, Trust me. We're gonna, like we had a harassment me. contest <laughs> against him last week. Do you know what a harassment contest is? This is where I say, give him a scare. Get into his comments. Give him a light college style scare. Nothing illegal. It's college style, Rob. Everything. I, mean, Rob. I, I beg of you to understand, Your Honor. Everything we do here is college style. Meaning innocent, nice, legal, allowed, and part of what America is about, college style. You know, I live uh, in a college town, and I am staring 
I am looking. I am driving with jewels, and we are looking at the girls. <laughs> <laughs> Their parents never understood. Um, there's lots of college people here. And uh, what was my point of it? Yeah, college style. It's, you could do anything you want in college. Nothing wrong with it. So we asked. We said we would give a prize. Oh, oh, shut the fuck up, Rob. Okay, uh, let's look at these great comments. I love harassing a new guy, you know? And, you know, here's something we don't know, though. Does this harassment work? Sure it does. You know, um, all of these guys, from the top guys up, they read these comments, and they really, this destroys guys, man. I'm telling you. That's why you tune in shows. Most podcasts you listen to are just guys talking about their disdain for all the people harassing them now. That's what every show is. I mean, really, we, we're we sometimes blown away on, you could tell like Casey Neistat is getting harassed. Death threats, <laughs> they're coming to his house. It's really wild. Like, that's what the whole internet now is. They've all finally figured out what Red Bar is about. We are like, me and Mike always say this, now we are like the nicest We are the nicest online. people. Everyone is so mean. <laughs> and even our own listeners are like meaner than me now. They're fucking brutal. I mean, people just, this is what they do. They get at their desk at the beginning of the day. They go, ah, yes. Oh, that was good. I had a little <laughs> crack there. And then they attack. It's attack all day, like me in the 90s. I love it, but I look at this internet and I go, I got to get the hell out of here. Man. This place ain't <laughs> safe no more. So, yeah, okay, this is what we're doing. We're harassing. I like to harass people, too. That's why you don't see me complain about no harassment on this show. I love harassment. So this is uh, some of the comments we gave, and you'll see the idea, and um, we do this to a lot of people. This idea is great. I love this one. So they went to his Instagram. I said the guy who has the best comment there will give him a prize, 200 bucks. I will pick that prize by the end of today's show. What do you think of my new uh, shirt, by the way, here? What do people think? This is LLB. I think you look incredibly hot today. Thank you. And if there's any other girls that think I'm hot, start fiddling around with me in those DMs. Let's see what we could get away with, huh? Right in front of her. She's sitting right next to me, too, all day. She don't know. I turn the phone like this. Hey, Jules, just playing candy corn. Uh, okay, here we go. So here's some of the comments. We'll get through these. So this is to Ron Weiner, and trust me, uh, you'll end up hating him. Uh, she says, don't worry about all this red bar stuff. Forgiveness is the most powerful thing in the world. You deserve it. Okay, that's from Max. So we're trying to scare Rob, and I like this. You know, um, a guy like Rob Weiner, his top day is 39 fucking comments, half of which are, you know, just his friends and family saying good job on the song and stuff like that. So, um, but today he got a shitload of weird comments like this. Fuck, man. What were you thinking? Hey, Ron, I just want to touch base with you again. Bad news. Have you done something wrong? People are speaking out against you in a very bad way. This guy, Red Bar, knows all the details and is putting together a seven- or eight-part doc <laughs> featuring interviews with victims. My stomach is in knots. Please don't ignore this. That's a good one. Write <laughs> that down. Let's good. enter him. That's sacred, sacred vox. Like that? So, yeah, you get the idea. Stop with the founded okay. on the web. Okay, you get the idea here? Um, let's see. Contrary, here's another one from BBB. Some, contrary to my profile picture, I'm not yet a boat owner, and I'm here to win a Seahawk, too. Very funny. But we already did one like that last time. Here's one. Uh, this is just so shocking, Ron. I didn't think you would do <laughs> all those things. There you go. I love when people play along, you know? And it's always good when it's against a guy like this. All right, here's some more uh, harassment comments. I love these. Here's uh, Gelato Buzz. He says, this is so shocking, Ron. I didn't think you would do all these things. California Shark replies. I love a reply in a harassment. Can't believe that second video. Okay, so you're making Ron, and believe me, this Ron is that is good. I can't believe the second. Thing. Yeah, I let see that's I'm smart. Man. That person. These listeners are smart. I know this whole investigation thing must be alarming, but just keep creating. You rule. That's a good one. These are all, all very good. So we're really these people are good. The people who listen to us are good. 
we need the good voices to rise to the top because right now only the creeps are rising to the top. If you're a good guy and you listen to this show, rise for me, will you? Uh, here's another one. Hi, Ron. Just wanted to give you a heads up about this Red Bar Radio guy. He has recently made a video after seeing you on that Amy Schumer show announcing that he will soon be releasing an exposed piece that he claims will ruin your career. I personally enjoyed your musical stylings on Schumer and thought I would warn you about this dastardly character. Cheers. Ooh. Wait, did you read the one that says, I know this whole investigation must be alarming, but just keep agreeing. Yep, that's the one I read before, Jewel. So everybody throw that tomatoes at her. That is really good. Sorry. That was, was really good. Yeah, I said that was really good. It's, it's okay, guys. She's... Um, How are you going to pick a winner? These are all too good. I know these are all too good. All <laughs> too good. Um, here we go. Sorry, bro, my bad. I've gotten a little excited over the exposed piece. Apparently, <laughs> it's only a light investigation. Love the tunes. Enjoy your day. Okay. <laughs> Hey, what's going on, bud? Seems like you're not telling people what's actually going on. If you're too ashamed, then just let me know, bro. I don't like being lied to. <laughs> Do the right thing. Otherwise, I can't help you and you'll be on your own. <laughs> Do the right thing. Your life might depend on it. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> Only kidding, bro. Love your work. Have a good one, dude. I mean, if someone left that coming yes. for me, I would be crying. <laughs> uh, here's another one. I don't believe them, Ron. Still a fan. You'll get through this. <laughs> That's bad. You'll get through this means you're fucked. If someone said that to me, I would fake sick. <laughs> Red Bar's accusations are pretty damning. Are they true? Better clear your name. Ooh, yep. You better clear your name. Right? And by the way, there's no accusations. We know nothing of this guy. We just hate him. Trying to give him a light college scare. All right, let's read a couple more here, and then we're going to pick our beautiful winner. Let's see. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't like what I've been hearing about you from Red Bar, Ron. A lot of concerning <laughs> accusations. Is there any truth to them? As a big fan of yours, I would like to hear your side on the story. Please respond. I'd love it if he you tuned know in to Red Bar these. to check out what's happening, and then he just, the accusations are just that his song fucking sucks. Well, no, I want to keep this going. Never blow the bit with Ron. Here's another one. This is good. You've been observed. Ron, you couldn't escape forever. You cheated, you lied, you distorted reality. Red Bar is watching. Beautiful. Here's another one. I'm honestly a bit disappointed in you, light of everything Red Bar has been revealing about you, but I just wanted to give you the heads up because I'm a fan and you seem like a decent, redeemable guy. I just hope some of these things aren't true. Very good. These are all very good. Um, okay, let's just do one more because there was a lot of these. A whole lot. There's already like six yeah. that I think deserve to win. So. Yeah, and there was pages and pages. Why won't that one show up? Hmm. Okay, we're skipping it. Did that one show up? They don't want to show up no more. How creepy. Um, sorry, let me just uh, figure out what's going on here. They won't pull up anymore. See Is that? that like minimizing? Oh, no, that's not nice. good. Yeah, it's like flashing a little bit, but then doesn't want to pull up. So that's a huge issue. Well, okay. Um, we're going to pick a winner. Uh, how about that one, the first one that I said? That was pretty good. What was his name? The first one that I wrote I down. I can't open Sacred anymore. Sacred Vatch. Sacred Vatch, you're one? the winner. <laughs> you want a border shot to shimmer. Okay. 